All right, guys, Shoddy T here. Third war of the season. Kabam has given us another reprieve. Despite losing the first two wars, we are still in tier three, but I'm pretty sure if we lose this next one, we're gonna be back in tier four. So, and again, it's that visual glitch. It shows tier four there, but multiplier times six. So for all intents and purposes, the multiplier is what matters. Um, but we're in this war. For some reason, they reversed the whole band thing. You used to be able to see it from the fight stream, but now you have to see it here. So opponent has banned Ghost, Hercules, and Torch. Um, and I've, I've already joined the battle group. Uh, my attack team is going to be pretty much almost completely different. Uh, this time, we're going to be bringing Kitty Pride. Um, I think it's the first time we're bringing her to war in the regular seasons. I have been using her in off-season war, so I've gotten better using her to, enough to bring her to war. And what I'll likely do, matter of fact, we'll probably go ahead and do this right now, um, is that we're going to go ahead and uh, put her to max sig because it's going to be needed for one of the fights for sure. Um, and I might end up rank four in her because at the end of the eternity of pain, um, because that awakening ability obviously it helps, but you get more power when you when the opponent misses. And that's gonna be relevant when you try to tank SP3s. Um, Cause that, I may have to use that tactic this war. So, um, but we're gonna be facing unstoppable armor once again. I got. Uh, America Chavez we got a Black Panther, so we're going to be handling all the first three fights. Uh, we're also going to someone, I believe, someone else is probably going to be taking Korg, I believe. Um, and then we also will have um, Guardian, who we're going to be using Venom for uh, Sorcerer once again for Nova, and we're going to be using Venom for. Warlock and then Kitty. This is the main fight I brought Kitty for. I can get free intercepts here without punishment. And then it's gonna depend on the rest of the I guess the, the team members as far as which mini I take. Um I could probably use Kitty against Longshot and Mangog. If I end up having to take Mangog, that's where that Matt Sig is definitely gonna come into play. And probably long shot too. Uh, so I'm prepared just in case I have to take those fights. And then if I end up going to the right side, I don't have as many vi as much viable options. I can probably take on Omega Sentinel with Venom. She is that is a tricky placement. But that's that's it. I can't take anything else on the right side. No one is poison immune. Uh, it's kind of dangerous to use Kitty against. Uh, I guess I could probably use her against Scorpion. But we got better counters out there, so no point being too experimental, especially first time bringing her to war. So, that being said, I think we're going to apply a six hour boost this time. We should be able to get to the top of tier two before we get, before, uh, before I go to bed, because it's what? five o'clock a little after five my time so we'll use the six hour boost for the attack and champion and i guess we'll use the uh, we'll use the health boost for that as well and we'll go ahead and use the that boost so this first fight america chavez we're going to use kitty we're going to try to build up her uh prowess so that way i can safely dash and intercept and I guess we'll knock her down after we get our third uh, prowess so that we can deal more damage. Don't know what type of MD this person have, but I'm assuming it's max. So here we go.
off right here, actually. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have fun with Kitty. Got my new toy. My new toy kitty. I think I'm, uh, yeah, she's probably gonna go to rank four. <laughs> I mean, that fight, I was kind of worried about that fight, but yeah, she made that fight pretty easy. All right, um, next, all right, we're gonna use a power start boost for this one um, because we don't have the Storm Pyramid X synergy, unfortunately, because I'm gonna need that, need to have that. And we're gonna start in this blessing here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna start in this one because I'm gonna knock him down, which will change my stance. So we'll go ahead and I wanna go ahead and get him there. We'll do it that way. Okay, they he went ahead and whatever one I applied first, that's what he went ahead and used. Now this will be a little tricky. If I don't, if I don't kill him right away, I'm gonna have to kind of time it. Yep. Let's go ahead and knock him down here. I get the placement. It's a good placement, though. Very innovative thinking they did there. Got a little sorcerer. I don't have to worry about an unstoppable armor here. Oh, gotta worry about that though. Gotta find that. It's all about that silly thing. Got to nullify those armors. Alright. Alright. Ricky mistake. It's like the oldest trick in the book there, if I didn't get him. Alright, anyway. Next fight here. Got Kitty against Nick Fury. Um. To be on the safe side, we'll use an invulnerability boost. Um, I mean, based off that first fight, probably don't need it, but just want to be on the safe side, you know. So we could do the same thing, really. Parry. broken if I had the uh, tiger synergy. That's why we got it. That's why that's why she's dead. That's why we got that protection, baby. Might as well kill them while I got that armor. Um not armor, but the um fury active. Oh boy, I'm gonna, I think I found a new toy, guys. <laughs> I think I found a new toy. Oh god, that was so that was so OP. Oh boy. I can use her literally on every fight. Who needs sorcerer? Uh, but I, I need a sorcerer for that. 
uh, Black Panther fight. But yeah, that'll do it for part one, guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and taxi my teammate um, just to spare that energy because I'm pretty sure she's taking on this Dr. Doom. I could probably take Dr. Doom with her too. I've seen Legacy take this fight pretty easily, but that's not, I didn't call it, so I'm gonna let who called it take it. And my next fight will be Guardian. See you guys soon. All right, guys, part two of the war. Uh, we still have our uh, six hour boost active. Uh, problems connected to the network's been pretty iffy, kind of uh, kind of alarming there. But uh, we're gonna use a uh, cosmic power boost, even though for Venom it's not the most effective boost, but we're gonna supplement it with a cosmic special boost as well. Uh, we're not gonna use any of the other boosts because this fight should be straightforward. I, mean, I got a, a big health pool. I almost got as much health pool as the person I'm going against. Plus he's a rank two, so actually this is probably over prepared for this fight. I didn't know he would be a rank two. I figured at this stage, everybody's becoming Paragon and stuff that we face in rank three defenders at a minimum, but still rank twos out there. Yeah, we got a five star defender out there, but it's not a hard, not an easy one. But here we go. Um, Could have used Sorcerer for this fight too. But I figured Venom, you know, he hasn't had a lot of war usage lately, so class advantage. Uh, manageable. Hopefully, we don't have any connection issues. Uh, come on. Kabam, don't do it to me. Don't do it to me, Kabam. Um, come on, Kabam, don't do it to me. Don't do it to me, Kabam. Well, don't do it to me, Kabam. I'm gonna go out and go back in and see what that does. Well, guys, um, hate to see it you hate to see it i got three bars so that ain't the issue i don't have wi-fi turned on because i know my wi-fi can be iffy at times so this is a kabam thing guys i don't know um this ain't cool this ain't cool Still hoping upon hope that this fight loads up, but if it hasn't loaded by now, unfortunately I'm gonna lose a bonus. But it is recorded live. I'm gonna screenshot this. So that might be the, I might have to insert one of my famous YouTube clips on this stage. I, I think I know, I think I know what uh, video I am going to load for this portion of the war. I'm waiting. I'm gonna give it, um, I'm gonna give it 30 more seconds. I mean, it's unfortunate, man. Why? Why, Kabam? Why? I'm not counting this as a death. I mean, I'm losing the attack bonus, but this is not on me. This is on Kabam. This is on Kabam. The maintenance hasn't started yet. I know it's on, actually it's Monday night, so it's not even maintenance. So I don't, I mean, the problems connected to the network thing hasn't popped up. It just wants to stay on the screen. Let's go out and go back in again. What the hell's going on out here? 
Um, well, guys, we're going to get out the game. Go back in. Got no choice. Because the game, it's not going to load at this point. The fight is not going to load at this point. I've, it's been a while since this happened to me, but I know that usually the fight should load within a minute. If I think that's the longest I've waited before it eventually loaded, but it's been more than a minute and it hasn't loaded. Yeah, pardon my French, you guys saw that in the chat. Uh, yeah, I, I, might, I might edit that out, you know, I might, I might edit it out. But yeah, I did a few swear words in the chat. You got me, Kabam. Congratulations. I'm going to have to reload. I'm going to have to hard reset the game and use potions because I fully boosted. Yep. Well, as you guys can see, the fight never loaded, so I had to restart the freaking game. Um, I hate this game. I mean, this game can be hateful at times. Maybe it happened to them. They got 10 devs. We're up, but they're pretty advanced in our defense. But I mean, you hate to lose bonuses like that. That's freaking ridiculous. So, fortunately, I'm going to have to use potions. I wasn't planning on using potions for this fight. Um, matter of fact, we'll save those. Because um, we can actually get these in the, lower, in the loyalty store. And it sucks, man. It better load this time. I mean, I, I don't know, man. I guess we'll use a combat regeneration boost now. Um, I mean, it's ridiculous, man. Uh, come on. Just have a function in the game. That's all we care about, man. That is all we care about. Have a function in the game. Now you want to load immediately. Necessarily more difficult. I'm not following that trap. I fell for it anyway. I'm gonna block it. I'm gonna block it. Yeah, that, that fight. That fight just got me so upset, Derek. It got me so upset. I hate to lose bonuses that way, man. It is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Well, come at regeneration boost will come in handy for this fight, I guess. But that's crazy, man. That's crazy. Just so random.
Not sure why I'm using this uh, rune as my saving one for SP3, but you know. And this is really her last fight, so as long as I get through the fight, I'm good. Just so upset with that timeout of death, man. Up. I mean, it's not me messing up, it's the game, it's just making it hard. Oh, it's over with now. It's over with. Move on. We'll use another comeback regeneration boost. I mean, I can actually purchase another one from the Glory Store anyway. Uh, not the Glory Store, but the uh, Loyalty Store. This is my least used boost that I normally use anyway. Um, so Venom is a great matchup for Warlock. Um, he can consume his armor break, his armor up. And I have pretty good access to, um, pretty good access to, um, intercept with him. He's a natural interceptor. And I don't have to worry about infection as much because of the amount of buffs I'll have on me. So... about that all right rhino I'm gonna take it out on you and you got an unstoppable armor too i have to pay attention to that other than that should be a pretty straightforward fight still got 15 seconds left on our heal easy access to intercept here
they got acting like Mordo. Might as well heal from this uh, armor break. I'm not gonna be cheesy guys, I'm not gonna cheese the rest of this fight like that with the healing. This AI is acting very passive, but that's for sure. methodically taking them down. Yeah, let's go ahead and throw the SB2. SB3, this might actually kill him with that armor. If not, get a chance to see her cheese factor with the SB3. Yeah, he should die from this, actually. <laughs> Oh man, I can't wait till I rank for her, man. The new, ah, yeah, I'm kidding. Can't wait till you rank four. Can't wait till the rank four. Oh, come on now. Come on now. I was gonna say, <laughs> I was gonna say, man, don't do this to me again. All right, I believe this is gonna be my last fight of the war because um, we have the boss island, I guess, communicated, so. We just gotta execute. So far, we're doing okay. We're up 10 to seven, but again, we got way more fights left to go, but normally we, yeah, we, we were, we're doing better. So we just, that one death here, there's a problem connected to the network. So I, I, I don't know what to say about that, but that'll do it guys. All right, yep, battery low, great. All right, good night. I'll update you guys in the morning well as you guys saw in my battlegrounds video we lost the war um not gonna say that the disconnection issues was the main reason why we lost obviously it didn't help uh because obviously once the war was over because as you guys saw throughout the opponent pretty much blitzed through our battle uh through our battlefield so they had a a standing number that we had to pretty much stay below and then once we got past 17 deaths we decided not to boost anymore i think we got the 20 deaths with like five or ten fights left so so the death toll is more inflated but still 15 is the magic number it would have gotten to win this war also even though this opponent is pretty good because they're part of the x-man family so we knew it was going to be a tough matchup but now I mean, we're still above 2600 so i'm not sure if we're going to be tier three or tier four next war but we just need to get a win i don't care what tier we're in because we're we're zero and three this is our worst start we've had um i know there's been a couple of changes so hopefully um we can get on the right track and still keep our goals ahead of us i mean our like i said our rating hasn't dropped too far but our rating as of right now uh we are platinum four uh with the official rankings come out and we're not like we're, we're not at the top of platinum four either so we got to do some work so to just to get into platinum three i mean we can still realistically reach platinum three um because we haven't we didn't do that last season so we can at least do that but we have to win 
But I um, hope you guys enjoyed that video. Like, share, comment below, subscribe, uh, hit the bell notification. And I believe there's Eternally a Pain Part 2 this week. So be on the lookout for that and more Battlegrounds. See you.